Hi everyone. Welcome to this initiative called Tap Take a Break. Here we'll pause for a moment from our busy and tensed schedule of Unlock 4.0 and portray you visual stories of people, their culture and their cuisines. Hi. This is Ayan from Take a Break. So, the one good thing that this COVID pandemic has done for most of us is that it has given us a chance to come back home and stay close to our near and dear ones and work from home. This brings us back to Kharagpur, which is our hometown. Well, Kharagpur is widely known as the rail city. Do you know what Kharagpur is famous for? Well, it has the third longest platform in the world. It also has India's first IIT. These two institutions bring thousands and thousands of people from across the nation who come and settle in. All these people are very diverse in every aspect of their livelihood, be it their cultures, their festivals, the languages they speak, or their cuisines. any kind of gathering be it social cultural religious communal or family calls for food be it uh, people coming and settling in from different parts of the country or be it students coming back to the campus after a long vacation all of them bring back delicacies from their homeland be it idli vada sambar or puri paratha sabzi for breakfast machhe chal or mutton kosha that goes so well with chada bhat or even biryani on a special day for lunch then comes munching on some pakode aloo chop along with tea or coffee or cutlets roadside chinese momos tikka fuchka chaat for a little snack break in the evening to roti paneer tikka butter masala chicken tandoori kharagpur has got all of it in small pockets of roadside stalls or as a little classy version of these inside spacey decorated restaurants or dhabas that have grown substantially based on the mixed cuisine that kharagpur sustains alongside an age old cafe culture that existed from far long back in kharagpur Recently popped up modernistic cafes have opened their gates to a twist of taste bringing in western dishes with an indian touch moreover one can never get over the considerable variety of sweets spread across ages old and new derrick shops that are part of more or less each and every cuisine as prasadam as a welcome note to the guests or as a dessert after a hefty meal come let's make a journey through the streets of kharagpur making stops at restaurants and tasting their distinct cuisines along with that telling you stories of how these grew up with the city which had a mere several hundred population in the early 1900s but grew up to be a major cosmopolitan most populated and multicultural city of the district